Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm Vincent Neil Emerson, and you're watching Cinder Block Sessions. Well, I roll in a town, gonna put my money down on a game that was made to live. With everything I have, I can carry on my own. Seven come and let I will speak Seven come and let you will see When I once I had a sweet girl Very young and fine I was her and she was mine she couldn't sing a note of it all on she wrote When we be coming home Seven come and let I will speak Seven come and let you will see Guitar You know, just sit there and I don't want to do work, so it's like I got a pen and a pad there, draw pictures and write little, you know, love poems or whatever, you know. I always like music, so, you know, just kind of made sense to pick up a guitar and try to write lyrics to music, you know. I just have so much respect for, you know, my grandpa. He gave me his, his CD collection when he passed away, and it's all that old stuff, you know, all the old country, old rock and roll early blues and stuff. I just have a high respect for those people that did that. I think it's important in music to to look back where you came from, where the roots are, you know, and kind of pay tribute to that. And there's also a lot of room, like all my stuff, you can call it, you know, classic country, you can call it, you know, throwback music, but I wrote it all, you know, I, it's coming from me, it's brand new, but it's in the style of, you know, there's a lot of garage rock bands these days that sound like pavement, you know, the same thing it's just we're going a little bit further back you know yeah I'm a bit of like a lone wolf I guess you call it. I don't know I kind of stick to myself but I got a lot of good friends you know that help me get by I think it's it's important to support each other but I, there's a lot of great stuff around to take influence from like I've taken so much from Charlie Crockett you know and from Craig City Nighthawks and and Leon too you know it's just kind of bouncing ideas back off each other you know I ain't gonna get nowhere unless you support each other, you know. I think that uh, success kind of is a, is a funny thing, man. I don't think a, a lot of people have different ideas of what success is, you know. 
Like, I could be successful right now. It just depends on how I look at the situation. But, yeah, I'd love to go on tour and, and play with people, you know, and just keep writing songs and making records, you know. Dade County Jail. That was a song I wrote about the guy who... I kept getting these phone calls from this guy in jail. Like, he uh, had my number. I was a new number. I just got the phone. He called me, like, every day, man, for a month. And I was like, dude, I can't, I can't answer a $15 phone call. But I did one day, and I was like, hey, man, I wrote this song about you. And he's like, oh, I've been trying to get a hold of my sister. And it's like kind of a love song, Long and After a Woman. So I was like, yeah, I wrote this song for you, man. And he's like, oh, cool. Later. Click. You know. Just didn't give a damn. That's fine. <laughs> well, I woke up drunk in the sand. Somewhere in the dead kind of jail. And I don't know. Where I went wrong If it weren't for bad luck I wouldn't have no luck at all So I called And hauled once again For my heart on the other end Oh, but darling She's far from that phone If it weren't for bad luck I wouldn't have no love at all Thank you. 